All right. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Jay Excel. We're here on the channel. We see the Excel wherever we fail. Look, man, I'm back at it again this time with another reaction. Um, now, crazy thing about this, I actually saw this song when it came out. I didn't listen to it. Hold on. Damn, my for my hairline is gone. But shit, I'm gonna fuck. But look, I actually saw this song come out, and I was meaning to react to it for y'all, but I don't know why I didn't. So we here with it now. R.I.P. to take off. You already know I made a takeoff video. Uh, if it's five best verses, if it's five best verses to me, and I explained why. Of course, there are like if you're just going off of lyrics type of verses. Yes, but I explained it why. Go check that video out after this. Uh, might be in the end screen. But without further ado, Quavo got to go off for, for my man Takeoff, bro. He got to. Let's see what he got. Fucking with the beat. I ain't gonna lie, he look he looked depressed. He looked depressed right here. Like he really do look like sad, bro. Like I like he looked like a face like I just don't know what to do with life right now. Like like and before we get started for real, you gotta really think like Quavo offset. Real talk, people, y'all don't know when y'all are going to lose somebody. I could be dead tomorrow, the next minute, the next couple seconds. You know, just like what happened to Hamlin on uh, with the whole football situation, he could have died right there on that field. You know, anybody could die at any second, but you have to cherish every moment. And I know that's very cliche, but you just do. Cause you just, you just don't know when people are gonna go. People take that shit for granted all the time. Uh, I've recently tried to start calling my mom more, um, because of this exact reason. Uh, not because uh, takeoff died. Maybe a little bit. That does have something to do with it. But you just, you just gotta cherish, bro. You gotta cherish. You can tell this coming straight from the heart. Remember the days we smoke big bus together. Remember the days we rock that cold jello. And I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie. I guarantee that most of this song is finna be just straight from like what he's saying right now, just straight experiences. To me, that's what I think. Remember the days we have our shit together. On the no side times are hard, but them days was better. No, I wish I had a time machine. Just so you can take a ride with me. I miss just how you smile at me. Okay. I feel like he could be saying more though. Without you, 
Mama, Mama. It's hard to see Mama love without you. You know he was feeling it. You know he was feeling it. Out in the galaxy, up in the stars, up in the universe. I fuck with the beat though. See you in heaven. See you in heaven. When I see you in heaven, I will be with my dog. Out in the galaxy, up in the stars, up in the universe. It's bigger than Mars. I see you in heaven. See you in heaven. When I see you in heaven, I will be with my dog. Look, bro. Look, bro. Obviously, I can't say I can't say nothing. I can't sit here and say nothing about how takeoff. I mean, how how Quavo feel, right? But this is one of the main reasons I was not trying to listen to this song because I knew I was going to be disappointed. Because I I I just knew. I'm like, look, Quavo, he, he, I, I fucks with Quavo heavy. I'm not trying to disrespect Quavo right now. I cannot, I cannot tell somebody how they feel and then put it on paper. Could I have done better? I don't know. I probably couldn't. I don't know. I'm not a fucking rapper. He's a rapper. But what I'm saying is, if y'all heard Gucci Mane's song about takeoff, I feel like that one was a bit better than this song right here. That's just my personal opinion. I actually, it was actually one of my first reactions, but it got deleted off my channel because I got copyright striked or not copyright strike, but copyright claimed. And I didn't know how to really do shit. That was my first, that was my first reaction. I think that was during stream. I think. But I just knew it wasn't going to be all that. I didn't want to be disappointed because, like I said, Quavo is my guy. I fucks with Quavo. I fuck with Offset. But I feel like he could have went in deeper. You know, maybe maybe on paper the words just wasn't coming out right. And he just, maybe he was just like, you know, I can't, I can't, I just can't. I, this is all I have to say. Me personally, I would have took a little bit more time then. You know, if you have to wait a year and then come out with this song, do that. But I feel like he has more that he could have said, but he just, he just, he didn't. But that's my take. Um, let me know y'all opinions down in the comments. If you like the video, press like. Um, please consider a subscription. We're trying to get to 100 subscribers and we're on our way there. Uh, that's my, that's my personal opinion. Keep going. Keep excited. I'm out of here, man. Peace.